finals going on? Do you have any thoughts on the first what? four games? First four games of the finals, have you been able to watch? The finals of what? <laughs> the NBA. I don't even know who plays in the NBA. Are you not particularly interested in the NBA? or? No, I have no interest in the NBA. Why not? I did, why? I'd rather go fishing, rather play golf. Okay. I've never been a big fan of the NBA. Why not? But why? What the hell does it need to be why? I just haven't been, I'd, period. I'd love to know why. Obviously, I didn't really uh, care much about it. Okay. Coach, did you, did you try to recruit Mike Miller when he was coming out of high school? How the hell would I know? How long ago is that? Uh, Jesus Christ. I can't remember who the hell I recruited 25 years ago. Hey, Coach. Hey. Thank you. Thanks. 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 Renowned basketball coach Bob Knight celebrated for his illustrious Hall of Fame career, which included three national championships with the Indiana Hoosiers, has passed away at the age of 83. Knight's family confirmed the news on Wednesday night, stating that he had been battling illness since April and had been in declining health for several years. In a statement, the family said, It is with heavy hearts that we share the passing of Coach Bob Knight at his home in Bloomington, surrounded by his loved ones. We appreciate the thoughts and prayers from well-wishers and respect the family's request for privacy during this time. Notably, Knight made history as the youngest coach at a Division I school when he began his coaching career at the age of 24 with the Army. However, it was his time at Indiana University where he left an indelible mark, amassing a record-breaking 661 victories and making 24 NCAA tournament appearances. Knight's first NCAA championship in 1976, during an undefeated season, remains unmatched to this day. Reflecting on his legacy, Indiana University Board of Trustees Chair Quinn Bugner remarked, I don't know that we will ever see another coach like him again. Bob Knight's remarkable coaching career included 902 wins and 29 seasons with 20 or more victories. He even led the U.S. Olympic team to a gold medal in 1984, albeit not without controversy. Knight's storied career was not without its share of incidents, including his infamous chair-throwing episode during a Purdue game and allegations of physical confrontations with players. In 2000, he was ousted from Indiana University for violating a zero-tolerance behavior policy. He later continued his coaching career at Texas Tech, achieving further success and becoming the all-time winningest Division I men's coach. Knight retired in 2008-2009 concluding his 42-year tenure as a head coach. Nicknamed the General, Bob Knight was not only a coaching legend, but also a complex and polarizing figure in the world of sports. His influence extended far beyond the basketball court, and his passing marks the end of an era in college basketball. Bob Knight is survived by his wife, Karen, and his sons, Tim and Pat.